college students by day, rising stars by night. This young band from the north suburbs called Axe and the Hatchetmen have scored a spot on this year's Lollapalooza lineup. Hatchetmen are, it's another word for hitmen, which we are not an ounce of. Several members, including lead man Axel Ellis, have never been inside the Lala gates. I've grown up like watching Lollapalooza from the lakefront, like I would bike to the lakefront. The band spends a lot of time in a garage built by Ellis's father, melding their diverse musical backgrounds together. We've got a really fun concoction, at least I feel like, of, of influences of jazz and blues and classic rock and alternative and surf. <laughs> While Ellis feels incredibly lucky to perform at the festival, his bandmate, Hunter Olszewski, feels slightly different. Yeah, no, it's, it's, I'm really nervous. When asked what advice he would give to young aspiring artists like himself, Olszewski urges them to just keep doing it. If little me was asking, um, yeah, playing a lot of blues would be the most fun thing I had in my head um, growing up in Chicago. Axe and the Hatchet Men are proud to be from the Chicago area. They have a special love for the city's outdoors and food selections. Red Hot Ranch is a burger joint you'll, you'll catch us at very often. If you happen to catch their set at Lollapalooza, the group hopes you genuinely have a good time. <laughs> I mean, if Billie Eilish is around, I'd love to say hello. Alice is grateful for his bandmates' dedication to each other and their music. I kind of won the lotto in that regard. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.